We turn now to IT Mate. Prosecutors have now filed formal charges of murder in the stabbing death of a Purdue student in his room. It happened in court this afternoon in Lafayette. IT Mate's Richard Essex is there. Chiba Shaw will remain in the Tippecanoe County Jail for the foreseeable future. Today, the judge told him that he will not be offered bail while he waits for his murder case to come to trial. Jimin Shaw had nothing to say to the cameras as he was let into the court this afternoon. The Tippecanoe Prosecutor's Office formally filed a charge of murder against him. In the probable cause, investigators say that Shaw murdered his roommate, 20-year-old Indianapolis native Varun Chetta, with a knife. Chetta was found by police in the dorm room the two shared with stab wounds to his neck and head. Shaw called 911 after stabbing Chetta and told the operator that he had killed his roommate. When police found him, he was covered with blood. Today, Shaw sat in the remote courtroom at the Tippecanoe County Jail and listened intently as the judge read the charges. He offered no explanation to the judge this afternoon on what happened between him and his roommate. During his initial appearance in court last week, Shaw said that he was blackmailed. Today, I asked his lawyer to explain what Shaw meant by being blackmailed. Defense has no comment at this time in this case. What he said that he was blackmailed. Could you explain a little bit of that? The Tippecanoe County prosecutor said that he does not comment on pending cases. Now, Shaw entered a plea of not guilty, which is common for a case like this. He is due back in court in early December. In Tippecanoe, Richard Essex, Wish TV, I-Team 8.